Ages ago, we vowed that we'd only ever use porrit foam as our filtration media. Purely porrit. I was always a little bit upset after seeing how cool a moving bed filter or fluidized bed filter looked. And basically, I love seeing a tank where the filter is part of the attraction. You know, like it, it doesn't need to be the ugly part, it can look cool. And what we've done now is we've used porrit aqua, which is a material used in wastewater treatment. We cut it into 25 volt squares, we put it into a tank that's suspended above the main aquarium, and we pump a heap of water through it. And this is the effect we get. We've got it under a little LED light here, so it's pumping in a bit of UV and blue purple light, which really accentuates the purple lilac color. The actual material remains really clean because it's not actually having stuff driven through it, it's constantly moving through it. And as that biofilm breaks off, new bacteria form, and that's how the uber effectivity of biological filtration occurs as you can see in this tank overstocked most people would say massive amounts of food going into it about a cup and a bit of wet food that we make up goes in here a day all the fish are well fed i think there's about 120 fish in this tank and what's cool to note is that regular testing after feedings and that's at half an hour and one hour shows up zero ammonia so that's really cool and that's due to the filtration media we've also got a matten filter on the far end and I think the one thing to remember is that humans want clean water, fish want biologically pure water. So we've had to merge both the fluidized bed filter with a sump kit. So the water passes through the sump kit and this is the reverse order. This is what the water passes through the very end. We go through sinful, which is a water polisher, then through carbon, which removes smells and colorants. We then go through four stages of porrit foam, 45, 30, 20, and 10. Now. The water goes through the 10 first and finally passes through the sinful, which means the water ending up in your tank is as clean as possible, but also as little cleaning needs to occur. And that's because each material takes out the specifically assigned size bits of dirt. In this tank, we've got a large collection of mixed African cichlids from both Lake Tanganyika, Lake Malawi, um, lots of open water haps, lots of lonicaras, as well as lots of mabuna. So it's a great tank to look at. And the best thing of all is that it's uber healthy for both the fish as well as for us to look at. Creating natural looking aquariums that are easy to maintain.